Hey everyone, how's it going today? We're gonna to be playing some Ymir. Ymir. And we're up against Erlang Shen. Sounds good, sounds good. Uh, let's use... Let's use ice cream skin. Gotta switch it up every now and then. We're against Snack in my boot. That's a cool name. That's a good username right there. Here's some ice cream for you. Anyways, like I said before, I'm trying to get some gameplay of all the Guardians. And of course, gotta get some gameplay of Ymir, right? I haven't uploaded a Ymir game uh, since the old map, I think. Uh, so we're gonna go with this one. I think I can go either Curse Tonk or Sunder against this guy, or Beads. Uh, let's start off with... Let's start off with the Sunder. So I'm not worried about his healing in the early. If anything, I can, I might not even need Curse Tonk. I could probably just get other types of anti-heal. And what I can instead get... Oh, did I just see him? Is this guy planning on invading me? No, maybe I'm, I'm seeing things. I don't know. For cherry on top. I don't know. No, I'm seeing things. Okay. But yeah, I haven't uploaded a Ymir game in a while. Uh, I like to start off with Gilded Arrow Tier 1 Bancrofts. Uh, just because Gilded Arrow goes into, you know, gives some attack speed, gives some base attack damage, which uh, Ymir, you know, gets double from because of his passive. And uh, when you upgrade it into Diamond Arrow, it gives you a ton of attack speed while still being able to build a, like a full power build, which is really good. Yeah, I, I thought I saw like him at the beginning in my jungle, but I did not. It's so weird. He does have mannequins, so I probably can't fight him straight on. Uh, you can build mannequins instead on your mirror if you want. I think Gilded Arrow uh, is a little bit more fun, but... Ah, if I hit that, I could have killed him. I'm just going to try to get the last hits here. Just for my Gilded Arrow. Get a little bit extra gold above of him, you know? Plus, if he goes on me, then I can turn. Just like that. I actually thought Erling Shen's three cleanse slows, because most dashes do. Uh, but I guess not, so he wasn't able to get out, which is good for me. Uh, let's go take our speed, and then we will recall and finish this Bancrofts. What a good, what a, what a great start to this game. Apparently, I am actually number one Ymir right now. I just checked. Even though I have a plat border, I'm number one. But I, the dual leaderboards don't matter. I When they came out, I thought they were so cool, and they... I don't know. I like being number one. But now I realize it really doesn't matter because the way it's calculated is so strange. Uh, like, if you're in Masters, uh, you don't have to win as much to be higher on the leaderboard, which is how it should be. But if you have a few losses, you can't get a GM border, which is sad. And also... Um, I, I mean, I, I just don't know how it's calculated. It's just so strange. Um, like if you have you know, just a few more losses, all of a sudden you're below uh, someone else that's playing way below you. It's just weird. I think it's mostly with uh, calculated with win streaks. And because the leaderboard doesn't update until you restart your game, sometimes it's hard to even see how it's calculated if you want to figure out figure it out yourself. I should delay his back. Oh, I missed. Sad. Because if we delayed his back, then he would have had to miss out on this entire wave. Now he's going to get some of it. Okay, a lot of Gilded Arrow procs. That was miss out on a few minions. Uh, so now what we can do is we can either decide if we want to go attack speed or if we want to go power. Uh, Gilded Arrow, when we upgrade that, will give us plenty of attack speed. Uh, but, and we do want some anti-heals, so I, I think I'm going to opt for a Divine Rune and not a Toxic Blade. I go Toxic Blade against uh, gods that like to run away a lot, and Erlang is kind of a in-your-face type god, so I think it's fine. Although, I'll sometimes go with Toxic Blade against him, too. Just depends on the build I'm going. He should have fought me. He should have fought me. That was a great fight for him to take. Well, maybe not. I, I mean, maybe not. Are, are you okay? Okay. He's walking into walls. He has Ikvol, which is great against me. Catch 
Gotcha. Okay. Ooh, he turned out the wrong way. I didn't need to ult, but why not guarantee the kill, right? Man, he actually... I actually missed with my two. <laughs> I want to clarify that that wasn't really a predict. I just straight up missed, and then he turned around and walked into it. So you, I mean, you could say it's a predict, but uh, there was no way to really predict that. I meant to throw it out a little bit in a different direction, but hey, it worked out. It's all well and fine. Oh, hello. I can fight this if only because of the items I have. I could fight that only because I had Bancrofts and because I had Sunder. If I did not have either, I'd not be able to fight there. Plus, I knew his uh, ultimate was down. Bancrofts gave so much power on my auto attacks. Like, my autos hit him for how much? 782? Oh, I should leave now, though. Whoops. Uh oh. Or we could bait him again. <laughs> Or we could bait him again. I don't know. That's great. Oh no, he got the heal off. <laughs> oh, he almost killed him though. That's so funny. I'm really far ahead. But now he gets my red buff. I don't want him to have that. Oh well. Let's go divine. And then we'll get a health chalice. And then we will get our blue buff. Considering I've killed him three times, I'm only one level ahead. It's mostly the gold I'm ahead in. I'm also getting so much gold from Gilded Arrow. I actually don't know how much I've gotten. Maybe like, <laughs> maybe like seventy gold. I don't know. I don't know how much it adds up to, but I feel like it helps. Right? Oh, did he? Oh, that's weird. My ward didn't give me the vision of the buff. It's so finicky on this map to be like completely inside the map to get the timer. All right, let's see. He is going a Toxic Blade himself. Uh, so he's getting at that heal. Oops. So one thing I like to do on Ymir is if I miss my freeze and I'm against a melee god, like they, they walk towards me and then they walk out of it to juke my freeze, I will immediately throw out my two almost no matter what, even if I miss my three. Because the second I miss my three, they're like, oh, look, Ymir missed his three. Now's my chance. And they just walk into the two. And it happens like all the time. It, it happens hurt? like all the time. Like it, hurt. it works against hunters sometimes too, but you take a lot of damage if it doesn't work out. I don't know. The downside is, of course, if you miss the two also, which I'll be, I mean, like I said, it works most of the time. Uh, if you miss the two also, then all your abilities are down. And then they really do have a chance to kill you. And you kind of have to ult or something like that. But I feel like a lot of time, because of how much, how many times it works out, it's like low risk, high medium reward, or maybe it's high risk. I guess, I guess I don't know. I don't know how to word it. Oh, let's get defense actually. And I need to save my second relic in case he gets horrific. Let's not forget about that. But, I mean, I, I guess the way I'm trying to say it is the risk is you can die if you miss both abilities. But the fact is, most of the time when I do that, it doesn't even, like, I don't know. I, I hit the two anyways, so it doesn't matter too much. Oops. Like, there I didn't have my two up, but if I did, I would have hit him. So I wouldn't say it's high risk, if only because it doesn't happen that often that you end up dying. Yeah, he's completely giving you this up. That's the right choice for him. Let's see how far ahead I am. He has finished his Toxic Blade. He doesn't have that much power except for when he's autoing me with Thickable. 
I'm very strong at this point. Like, if he tries to ult me, I could probably bop him before. Because he doesn't have defense. He's yet to get his defense, so he does just super fast. Exhibit A. <laughs> Exhibit A on how he dies very fast. We can actually take this because it enhanced red, enhanced red and my gilded arrow. Your team has destroyed a middle enemy. Very nice. Everyone wants eat me. Um, let's get a, let's upgrade this. And I am going to he got a blink, so I feel like I can get a blink as well. Or something just as fun. I don't think I need uh what's it called? Curse Donk. I don't need Curse Donk. He's not healing that much. And quite frankly, his build uh, doesn't have that much healing either. Like, it's not like he has an awesome healing. Even if they did, it's like Divine Rune's fine. And if you decide to get a bunch of healing, I can always get Toxic Blade. I usually get Curse Donk against uh, Erlang, but that's when they are rushing defense and that heal is so big because they're healing effective health because they have more defense. Rather than if he doesn't have defense, yeah, he heals the same amount, but that health is almost nothing because there's no protections to back it up. Oh, nice blink. <laughs> nice blink. Oops. Hold on, I got a blink of my own. Hold on. I got a blink of my own. <laughs> He accepted it. He accepted it. Do be like that, Erling. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, little one. But I haven't won yet. The front time is too low. still have another Sunder proc. I don't have my ult, but I mean, I just feel like I'm so far ahead that I can take a fight. As long as I don't... I would need to hit my freeze, though. And we heal so much, too, just because Bancrofts. Oh. That was not what I intended to do. This is not what I intended to do, either. <laughs> I bet he thought he was pretty good or something. I messed up. That's okay. When he went to the right, that kind of caught me off guard. And in a way, I was like, this is my chance. But then I realized, nah, Titan's right here. I'm taking too much damage. I have to remember that we're literally only 12 minutes to this game. I shouldn't even be at this Titan, quite frankly. <laughs> the Phoenix shouldn't even, should, shouldn't even be down yet. <laughs> All right. Let's keep going. I got a Demonic Grip. I mean, he doesn't really have defense, but Demonic Grips gives me so much DPS with the attack speed. Anyways. Your middle tower is under attack. I guess the Demonic Grip in this situation is kind of like, yeah, you don't have defense, but now if you get defense, it's not going to matter anyways. That's kind of what my build is doing right now. So let's clear a wave and get the left red buff. That will get us ready to take his Phoenix again. Oh, hello. Good stuff. Wow, you're pretty good at this. How much have I all did him for? 1200? Yikes. Yeah, he's going full blaster, man. He's going full, full blaster. Like, not a single defense item was given, but hey. Uh, I gotta respect the full blaster build, I suppose. GG's. Well, there's your Ymir game, you guys. Uh, I figured we'd get one of those. Uh, I'm slowly getting through all the Guardians, or at least the, all the Guardians I enjoy. That's mostly what I'm trying to do. Uh, thank you all for watching. I appreciate it. And if you guys could like, comment, sub, you know, I appreciate that as well. And yeah, uh, I'll see you guys next time.